Okay, all right. Now, we always get started with the hello song and I do see everybody coming in and we are right on time for 1030. So you guys ready for our hello song? I think you guys are. You guys were ready. Dancing so silly. All right. Ready? Welcome to the if you have your egg or your stuffed party. animal, you can dance with them with us. Jump ready? Jump up, jump up, jump up high. Jump down, jump down, jump down low. Jump up, jump up, jump up high. Wiggle, 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 let's go. Running, running, running fast. Running, running, running slow. Running, running, running fast. Wiggle, 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 let's go. Flying, flying, flying high, flying, flying, flying low. Flying, flying, flying high. Wiggle, 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 and stop. Come on, boys. Very good, guys. Let's see some doing dance moves. Very good. Everyone's dancing. Look at you guys. Good morning. Clapping, clapping, clapping loud, clapping, clapping, clapping loud, clapping, clapping, clapping loud, wiggle, 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 let's stop. Clapping, clapping, clapping fast, clapping, clapping, clapping slow, clapping, clapping, clapping fast, wiggle, 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 let's stop. Twist up, twist up, twist up high, twist down, twist down, twist down low, twist up, twist up, twist up high, wiggle, 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 let's stop. today so if you guys have any issues go ahead oh you saw oh we have six more weeks of sledding i saw miss terry write to us here i can't say his name picks one knee <laughs> phil saw his shadow oh no we're gonna have more snow but that's okay because we can go sledding but today we're gonna learn about groundhogs so the first thing we're gonna do is our egg song. You guys have those egg shakers. If you don't, that's okay. You have something that shakes. If not, you can just shake your hands. That's fine. You guys ready? We're gonna start with this song. Egg shakers up and egg shakers down. Egg shakers dancing all around the town. Dance them on your shoulder. Dance them on your head. <laughs> Dance them all around, then tuck them into bed. Very good. Do it again. Ready? Egg shakers up and egg shakers down. Egg shakers dancing all around the town. Dance them on your shoulders. Hey! Dance them on your head. <laughs> Dance them all around, then tuck them into bed. I see all of you guys tucking them into bed. We'll do it one more time and then we'll go to our letter of the day. Ready? Egg shakers up and egg shakers down. Egg shakers dancing all around the town. Dance them on your shoulders. Hey, dance them on your head. What are you doing there? Dance them all around and tuck them into bed. Oh, I think we made them tired. We've been dancing with him all morning so far since we've started. But hey, that's okay. The letter of the day today is the letter D for dark. We did S a lot this couple of weeks, so we're gonna go with D for dark. Shadows can be dark, right? Shadows are dark. And to do dark for the sign language, I'll show you guys. You're gonna take your hands, you're gonna put them up like that, and you're gonna go like that, this dark. Like at night, it gets dark outside, right? It's dark outside. Very good. Did everybody bring their letter of the day? Oh, I see Tashin has her letter D. I see dinosaurs. 
a, oh, I see lots of doggies, lots and lots of doggies and dinosaurs, a doll. Very good. Lots of doggies, lots of dolls. Very good guys. I think we all love dogs. A ducky, Cushy, you have a ducky. Ooh, Parthada, I see your Dalmatian. Very good, Anvi. Lots of goodies. Oh, duckies and doggies and dinosaurs galore. Very cool. I feel like Dorothy. <laughs> Very good, guys. Go ahead and do that all day today. If you see anything that starts with the letter D, you should point it out or point it out <clears throat> and say it. D. All right. Are you guys ready for our first book? I'm going to show you this one first. For our parents that are watching too, it's a little fun nonfiction book about Groundhog Day. Has a lot of facts and fun facts and stuff. I'm not going to read too much of it, but just shows a lot of good info and lots of fun colored, colorful pages. But our first book today is going to be Groundhog's Day Off. Whew. Groundhogs get a day off. Whew. Let's see what happens, shall we? Every year on one special day in February, Groundhog wakes up extra early. Crowds of people gather outside, locals, tourists, even the mayor. News reporters with big microphones and big shiny teeth are waiting. Every year they ask Groundhog the same thing. What do you think they ask the groundhog every year? Did I see it? Did you see your shadow, Mr. Groundhog? Let's all say it together. Ready? One, two, three. Did you see your shadow? Did you see your shadow? Or another good question, are there going to be six more weeks of winter? Is spring around the corner? Oh, this poor groundhog. Everyone's asking him so many questions about the weather, the winter. But the one thing that they never ask is about him. No, how are you feeling? No, have you seen any good movies lately? No, do you like mushrooms on your pizza? Ugh. Not even, who does your fur? Groundhog has more to offer than the forecast. But that's what happens year after year. Poor Mr. Groundhog. <clears throat> Poor Mr. Groundhog. I wonder who does his fur? Who do you think does his fur? Hmm. Maybe he'll tell us later. Well, not this year. Mr. Groundhog wrote a letter. Dear people, I am a groundhog with feelings and things to say, but all you care about is the weather. So this year, I'm going on vacation and you'll have to find someone new. Sincerely, Groundhog. P.S. I'm taking my shadow with me. Groundhog packed his robe, slippers, magazine, and shadow and headed for the spa. Look at his letter. Look at him here. He's all ready to go. He's going to go to the spa. Is he going to go relax? The townspeople didn't know what to do. The mayor thought long and hard and finally announced, we'll hold auditions for our new groundhog. Lots of animals wanted to try out for the role. A lot of animals are trying to be the groundhog. Can other animals be groundhogs? Do you think that would work the same way as a groundhog? Let's see. Who's up here? Do you guys see who's up there first? What does that look like? Look at that tail and his bandit eyes. Is that a raccoon? A raccoon is trying out to be the groundhog. Hmm. Elephant was just too big. An elephant, he's huge. Ostrich got the whole thing backwards. Poor ostrich. What did the ostrich do? Instead of coming out, he put his head in the hole. Whoopsies. Silly ostrich. 
Monkey was asked to leave after an unfortunate banana cream incident. Oh, silly monkey. He started throwing the pies instead. Oh, monkey. You have to come out to see your shadow. Bats, owls, moles, and possums, their schedules didn't work out. They sleep in the day. Look at they're sleeping. Oopsies. These guys sleep all day. The owls and possums and moles. <sighs> Poor puppy. He suffered from stage fright. And Sheldon, well, his shadow wouldn't behave. Sheldon's shadow wouldn't behave. Sheldon's shadow kept running away. Look at that. Oh, this is terrible, the mayor cried. There's only one animal right for the job. The poor mayor. Look at the poor mayor. She's out of her wits. She's not sure what to do. What are they going to do without the groundhog? You see who's behind her? Is that the ostrich? Sorry, it's a little hard for me to see so I can make sure you see. Oof. Groundhog had been relaxing when he heard the news report. Nobody has groundhog's uh, flair for the dramatic. Nobody can wake up as early as he does. No one, the mayor said, pausing, is as special as a groundhog. Oh. He was relaxing and he heard this really nice news about him. What do you think the groundhog's going to do? Is he going to go back? Let me see some yes. Do you think he's going to go back? Yes or no? You think he's going to go back? I see a lot of yeses. All right, let's see. Let's see what he does. <gasps> Groundhog couldn't believe his ears. They do think of me as more than just a weather vane. And with that, he threw on the towel and whistled for a taxi. That's the groundhog whistling for his taxi. All right, taxi, he's on his way home. Groundhog tunneled under the stage and popped out of the hole. Ta-da! Ta-da! <laughs> he made it back! Da, I'm here. The audience stood and cheered. The reporters asked Groundhog all the questions he had hoped they would ask. Where did you go on vacation? Which team are you rooting for in the playoffs? Do you prefer chunky or smooth peanut butter? Is that your real fur? Aw, yay. They finally realized they couldn't do it without him. Look at that, yay, groundhog. All right, what will you do? Um, will this, uh, will you do this for real tomorrow? The groundhog stopped signing autographs tomorrow, he said. The reporters nodded, tomorrow is groundhog day. You came just in time. Well then, no time to talk. I have to go to bed early. Ooh, Mr. Groundhog's going to bed. He's off. Look at all those people asking him so many questions. All right, good night, Mr. Groundhog. Good night, let's see what he says for us today. The next morning, Groundhog woke up extra, extra early. He poured himself a warm mint tea and brushed his teeth peeked out of his hole. And this time the reporters asked him much more about the weather. All right, now is the day to ask Groundhog about the weather. Look at him, he's brushing his teeth. That's a good little Groundhog. Gotta get all the fuzzies off. What would we do without you? Do, 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 do. They're relying on Mr. Groundhog to tell them, tell them the weather. Ooh, bagels or donuts? Do you guys like bagels or donuts? Donuts. What would you do with a million dollars? Seriously, is that your real fur? 
everyone is just talking and talking to him. Look at that. He is just talking away. We need to know all about Mr. Groundhog. You like me, you really like me, Groundhog said with a huge smile. He finally felt like everyone cared about him. He was very happy. That is, until he climbed back in his hole. <gasps> Look at it's nighttime. Do, 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 do. Let's see what he's gonna do. <gasps> he turned on the television and he saw that the bunny hopped away Oh, it turned out to be spring. Sorry, I forgot to say that, guys. It is spring for these guys. But he saw that the bunny had hopped away and auditions would be held in spring. Uh-oh, for Easter now, the Easter bunny and the groundhog are on vacation together. Look at that. So in the book, it turned out to be spring for them, but we have more winter. It's okay, more time to play in the snow. All right, guys, I want to see you get a big stretch because that was a long story. So go ahead and get him a big stretch real quick. Ugh. All right, and we're going to do our next song so we can get our, our dance out. It's called Shadow. Oh, Groundhog. You have your egg, you can get your egg. Found a lonely shadow in the woods. No one to love it, make it feel good. Brought a little shadow to my home. today or I know if you didn't. You haven't seen your shadow yet today? I don't think I did. I didn't see my shadow today. But if you do, make sure you say, yes, I see my shadow. Make sure you let them know you saw your shadow. All right. So the next thing we're going to do is uh, we'll do our five little groundhogs so you guys can see these little guys. And we're going to start the first little groundhog digs a hole in the fall and he curls up into the winter like a ball. The second little groundhog comes out of his lair on February 2nd to get some air. The third little groundhog looks up at the sun, never do that. Then he sees his shadow and he goes on the run. Ah, so he sees the sun is there and then he looks at his shadow and he runs, 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 runs. Ah! Okay, he's back, so we gotta count them. <laughs> and the fourth little groundhog at his dark shadow peaks, then he goes back to the burrow for six more weeks. 
Then the fifth little groundhog hopes that the skies will be gray so that he will know that spring is on his way. Oopsies. <laughs> My groundhogs fell. Whoopsies. That's okay. But I think they're going to hide now for spring, but we have winter, so that's okay too. But say hi to the groundhogs. They'll see you later. Alrighty. I'll put them here because one of them has flown away a little farther than I could reach right now. <laughs> Alrighty. So we'll do groundhog, groundhog. Give me one second. All right, sorry. All righty. Well, that book was a lot longer than I thought it was gonna be. So what we can do then is, we'll do our groundhog, groundhog. I just thought I had my sheet and I didn't and I'm so sorry. One quick moment. All right, so this one's called groundhog, groundhog and it goes to Baba Black Sheep. And Baba Black Sheep, if you don't know, goes ba ba black sheep have you any wool so that's the tune we'll be doing but we're going to do it to the groundhogs so i will just go along with it first i'll probably do it one or two times but the lyrics will be in our newsletter if you would want to follow along later today you guys ready i'm going to go ahead and do it and if you have your eggs you can go ahead and follow along Groundhog, groundhog, popping up today. Groundhog, groundhog, can you play? If you see your shadow, hide away. If there's no shadow, you can stay. Groundhog, groundhog, popping up today. Groundhog, groundhog, can you play? Very good. Do it one more time with you guys. And then I'll probably read a little bit of Gregory's Runaway Shadow, but it looks like we're getting close to that time. But here we go. Groundhog, groundhog, popping up today. Groundhog, groundhog, can you play? If you see your shadow, hide away. If there's no shadow, you can stay. Groundhog, groundhog, popping up today. Groundhog, groundhog, can you play? Very good. See a lot of us bouncing around. It's a fun one. It's a cute little rhyme. All right. So we're getting close to that time. What I will do then is just show you Gregory's runaway shadow really quick here because there's only a few more minutes left and I want to make sure we do our fun goodbye song. But I'll read a little bit for you because this is cute. It's a fun one too. Who do you think is Gregory? Is Gregory in the white shirt? Can I see some yeses or noes? Yes, no. Gregory's in the white shirt. Yes, very good, very good. The only thing that kept up that could keep up with little Phil Groundhog was his shadow. No matter how fast he ran, pew! no matter how fast Mr. Gregory ran, or sorry, Mr. Phil ran, or how high he jumped, or how high he jumped, whenever he laughed. <laughs> Let me see some laughs. <laughs> Whenever Mr. Groundhog laughed, or when he cried, boo -hoo -hoo -hoo, when he cried, his shadow was always right there by his side. Even when Phil felt so small, his shadow could make him feel even bigger. Let's see what he's singing. Ooh, pretty hippos out walking with gorillas down my street. That is what he's singing. Look how big his shadow is. Ooh. All right, that's just the beginning. If you guys want to keep reading, you can check it out. There's just only so much time left. I wanna make sure we get our last song in. But yes, I want to challenge you guys to play with your shadows today. So if you see your shadow, see how small you can make it by walking closer. 
and then see how big you can make it by walking back. All right, so I wanna see some fun shadows or we can, you know, from home. But yes, we're gonna do our goodbye song since it is that time. And I just wanna make sure we were able to do it because I know how much you guys love that goodbye song. You guys ready? Let me see some yeses if we're ready to dance away our goodbye song. Yes, 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 yes. Very good. Ready? when you go outside. Bye.